So, Huawei Harmony OS 3.1 is loaded with lots of features, and Android 13 is also in line with the latest offerings. These two prime softwares are designed for a better user experience, and these two operating systems are rolling out for various smartphones. Both Harmony OS 3.1 and Android 13 software have their own set of weapons. And in this video, we'll compare some of the newest features of these two mobile operating systems. But before further we do, if you do end up liking what you see here, please consider subscribing and turn on notifications by hitting that bell icon. Now let's get back to the video. So, Harmony OS 3.1 brings a new auto layout feature that allows you to restructure the home screen content based on the original layout. Or you can sort by color or just by category. However, Android 13 has no feature to manage the screen layout. One of the most innovative feature of Harmony OS 3.1 is its app snippet. The feature allows you to open key features of an application without opening the app first. Once again, Android 13 don't give such access to the feature. Huawei also introduced large folders with Harmony OS 2, and Harmony OS 3.1 gets you a new range of layouts. Large folders is a real innovation, and several Chinese phone makers have copied this feature from Huawei. However, stock Android 13 lacks it, but the software follow the traditional app folder instead. So, service widgets enable you to preview app info and access app features. However, Harmony OS 3.1 gets you additional gifts, such as group and stack widgets. Android 13 also lets you add app and service widgets, but it doesn't offer you the same level of compatibility as Harmony OS. However, you can resize the widgets similar to large folders by stretching anchors, which looks pretty neat. Harmony OS 3.1 has one of the best quick settings on all smartphones. With Harmony OS 2, Huawei introduced a separate space for notifications, but the company improved the control panel and notification center with this upgrade. Similar to Android 12, stock Android 13 follows the tile-powered quick settings. These are pretty big tiles, with a brightness controller, edit button, and shortcut for the settings menu. However, I recognize that the virtual power button on Android devices is missing on Harmony OS. So, what do you guys think about all this, let me know in the comments down below, and as always, I will see you guys in my next video.